our loving Father, God Almighty, attests Pastor Dill's ministry with immediate signs, wonders, miracles, and healings as great multitudes throng to Jesus, praising Him, thanking Him, and loving Him, our Lord and Savior. Jesus loves you, Jesus will bless you, Jesus will take care of you, how much the Lord will do for us because he is always a God who serves us, he serves us. That's why when he rose from the dead, Jesus said, come and dine, John 21 verse 12. So this morning, Jesus is calling us to come and dine. He is going to feed us. He is going to feed all of us. I have nothing to give you. It's all the Holy Spirit. The Word is Jesus. The Word is Jesus. The living bread is Jesus. He takes from Jesus and gives to me to give to you all of us. I humbly come along with my dear precious wife Suhanti and our one and only daughter Divina. We come to the cross. The blood of Jesus washes me, cleanses me, whiter than snow. Holy Spirit takes the word from Jesus and gives to me to give to all of us. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Nothing in my hands I bring Simply to the cross I cling Naked come to thee for dress, helpless look to thee for grace. Rock of ages cleft for me, 
Let me hide myself in thee. Jesus loves you. He loves every one of you. God is our Father, Abba Father, Abba Father. Oh, He is there for you. He loves you. Oh, beloved ones, the Holy Spirit takes us to Mark's Gospel, chapter 5, Mark's Gospel. The same incident is there in Luke's Gospel, chapter 8, my loving children. And He loves you. He loves you in Matthew's Gospel, chapter 9, chapter 9 and Mark's Gospel chapter 5 and Luke's Gospel chapter 8. And as we go, a man who was in charge of a synagogue comes running to Jesus. He was head of the synagogue, the priest of the synagogue, and he comes, his little child, his little daughter. Luke's Gospel says, 12-year-old daughter, little child, the Bible says, was at the point of death. Death is defeated today and forever. But on that day, before the blood was shed, before Jesus died for our sins and saved us and rose from the dead and gave us life, life, life until rapture and eternal, with our child and family, your children and family, or in whatever way you are, he loves you, loves you, loves you. Rejoice, my dear children, rejoice. Here is a father, desperate, desperately seeking Jesus. No peace, no joy. He doesn't know what to do, but he thought of Jesus. In that dark moment, he thought of Jesus. Oh, beloved ones, even in the darkest moment, the blood is still there for us. The blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus. He shed his blood so that we will live, live and be healed and live, be saved and live. Oh, it's all Jesus when he comes in into our lives, when he comes through his spirit, by his spirit, when he comes to live in us. Oh, the blood he shed for us 2,000 years ago as a man, as a man on that cross, son of man, holy, holy, holy. He shed his holy blood to save a sinner like me and all of you, dear ones, anyone. All our sins are forgiven just by the blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus. Rejoice, rejoice. He loves you, loves you. You are not a sinner. You are not a cursed person. Nothing will work. No more death. Death is destroyed. Curse is destroyed. Jesus is risen, risen. Believe, believe. Holy Spirit is there today. He is there with us everywhere to help us to believe, to strengthen us to believe, to open our understanding to believe and to know and to know and to know Jesus, to know him, to know him is everlasting life John 17 verse 3 says he loves you loves you no matter who you are no matter from where you come Jesus loves you Jesus shed his blood for you today know this today know this today know this he loves you he's not far away from us he's among us he's within us through his spirit through his spirit though literally physically risen from the dead ascended to the right hand of the Father, the greatest power, the throne in heaven. Jesus is seated in heaven, hallelujah, with his body, resurrected body. We will see him after rapture with our families, our generation. We have work to do in these coming more long years. Rejoice, he loves you, loves you, loves you. And this Father came ru running to Jesus, helpless, helpless, knowing not what to do. And he told Jesus something. He told his request. He told his supplication. But there was something that was outstanding. There was something out of the ordinary in this father, this uh, chief of the synagogue. What was it? He completed and he concluded and culminated his request with words of heaven. What did he say? Though my little... Uh, child is almost dying, when you come and lay your hands on her, she will be healed and she will live, she will live. 
my loving children. These are the words that must come from our mouth, words of life, words of heaven, words of holiness, words of peace and joy and kindness. Oh, he is there today, words of truth and honesty, words of righteousness. It's all heaven's words. No matter what you go through, the blood is there for you. You are going to be victorious. We are going to be victorious. Jesus won every victory for us, defeating Satan and death and hell and curse and all hell. The victory has been won my loving child. Therefore, today, Jesus is asking you and me and all of us to come and dine. He's serving us the victory. He's serving us life. He's serving us life in abundance. John 10, 10, long life, well satisfied with salvation. Psalm 91, 16, until rapture and eternal. Rejoice and come, no matter who you are. He's your father. He's your savior. Jesus of Nazareth, he loves you. He's risen. He's risen. He's risen with his body. He lives. He lives. He lives. And because Jesus lives, we shall live also. Hallelujah. Our homes, our families, our generations until rapture and eternal. Be not afraid. Every fear is going away. Every fear is going away. Every hurt is going away. Every doubt is going away. Every sin is going away. Every consequences of sin and the nature of sin is going away. He's washing us right now, right now. He loves you, loves you, loves you. My dear children, Jesus I am sure was would have been so rejoicing because that man said, my child will live, will live. How sure, how sure he was. Are you sure of Jesus? Are you having all your assurance in Jesus? Are you having the fullest confidence in Jesus? If not, today, Holy Spirit is helping you, strengthening you, opening your eyes of faith to know Jesus, to know Jesus, to believe to believe that he loves you. He gave his life and rose from the dead with his body, shedding his holy blood, washing our sins away because he loves you, loves us, loves us. We are not sinners. We are the children of the Most High God. God is our Father, our Father. He loves you. He will do it for you even now, my loving children. Oh, he loves you. Jesus went with him, the Bible says. Jesus went with him. Oh, beloved ones, in, in truth, this man was taking Jesus with him. Oh, dear ones, when you speak faith, when you confess faith, when you speak words of heaven, words of life, words of victory, words of purity, words of peace, joy, words of holiness and obedience and truth, oh, and love and kindness and compassion and mercy, my dearest child, oh dear children, Jesus will come with you. He will come wherever, yes, where, my, where I am, my servant will be there with you, with him. John 12, 26, wherever you are, I will be there with you. Joshua 1, verse 9, yes, I will never leave you, never forsake you. Matthew 28, Verse number 20, Jesus says, He is Emmanuel, God with us. Matthew 1, 23, God in us. First John 4, 4, John 14, verse 17, He is in us through His Holy Spirit, through His Holy Spirit. Do not fear, do not fear, do not fear. Place your trust in Jesus. Trust Him with all your heart. Trust Him with all your heart. Proverbs 3, verse 5. He loves us. He loves you, loves you, loves you, loves you. He is today healing us. He is today saving us. He is today holding us. He is coming with us wherever you are. You are not alone. You are not alone. You are not alone. He is with you. He is with you. He is with you. My dear children, he will never leave you, never forsake you. He is with you. He is with you. Oh, Jesus loves you. And while go going on the way, there was another miracle, mighty miracle, a woman with a 12-year uh, issue of blood. 
in the modern day terminology, it could be called blood cancer or what, HIV or whatever, anything related to blood, we don't know. But in those days, they didn't have this kind of discovery of science and terminology. It was an issue of blood, passing of blood, passing of blood for 12 years. My loving children, he loves you, he loves you, he loves you, he loves you. My dearest children, he is there with you. He is there with you. He is by your side. My dearest children, such miracles, healings have happened in our ministry. It's documented. It's evidenced. It's all in our magazines. My loving children, oh, he loves you. He loves you. He loves you. And there was once a lady who came into our miracle healing rallies like this, passing blood, passing blood losing life she was seated somewhere there and the holy spirit came upon her during the preaching during the word of god and all of a sudden she knew she has been healed healed she tested herself every symptom had gone pain had gone the flow of blood all stopped she fresh she felt so fresh and strong that's what the holy spirit does he is the power of god he is the might of god he refreshes you strengthens you heals you and she was so rejoicing my dear and sent a testimony oh beloved ones jesus has done this for many of you how many healings miracles the lord has done especially through this ministry oh that's why king's revival church international uae is loved everywhere, even in the UK, even in the UK, the amount of invitations. My loving children, it's not show and money or all that kind of thing, silver and gold, never. This ministry is known, world-renowned and world-loved very much because of the love of Jesus, love of Jesus and the testimonies that God does what God does, beloved ones. People are amazed, my loving children, to see that they say it's a true representation of Jesus, true representation of Jesus. And some say it's a pure ministry, out of the ordinary, they say, all kinds of testimonies come. But the, the, the good side of everything is, the truth is, it's all Jesus. He heals the broken heart. He wipes the tears of the people. He comes down in his Holy Spirit and heals and saves and wipes the tears of the people. My loving children, he is doing it in UK, he is doing it worldwide, in UAE, my loving children. Therefore, my dear children, and what more? Jesus is there with you, with you right now. He will do it right now, even today, as you are seated, as you are seated. Every defeated back pains, every defeated back pains, every defeated ailments in your body, every defeated fever, every defeated body pains and tiredness will be just washed away by the blood of Jesus. Every weaknesses, every addictions, oh, he will never condemn us. He will never. He is your father, your savior. Just know he has called us. He has asked us to come and eat his living bread and drink the living waters. He loves you. There is life to your soul. There is life to your spirit. There is life to your body. It's happening. The Holy Spirit tells me to your lungs, to your lungs. The river of living waters is flowing to your lungs, to your breathing organs right now as you are seated or standing, whatever you want to do. But receive, Jesus says, come and dine. He loves you, loves you, loves you, loves you, loves you. My loving children, he loves you. And Jesus went with him. When he went to the house, oh, as he was going, the news came. The little child, the little child is dead. We call now defeated, defeated death because Jesus died on our behalf and he rose from the dead so that we will not die, but live, live, live our homes, our families, our generations until rapture and eternal. Do you know that? That's Bible, John 8, verse 51, John 11, verse 26, John 14, verse 19, John 10, verse 10, Psalm 91, verse 16. Rejoice, he loves you, rejoice, he loves you. 
my loving children and dear ones. Jesus got little uh, uh, occupied in this miracle. A lady, 12 years issue of blood, came and touched his garment and was healed instantly. And this father was watching all this. A, a miracle had happened right before his eyes. A, a woman, 12 years of issue of blood, and his little daughter was also 12 years. I'm sure the, the father would have realized. That's why seeing this miracle, seeing this miracle, he would have wondered, it will happen to my child, it'll happen to my home, it'll happen to me, it'll happen to anywhere, wherever, whatever you need today. That's why we have testimonies in our magazines, every magazine, everywhere, it's testimonies, healings, miracles, life in abundance. Take these things, read even my books. My books carry testimonies, my loving children. Oh, dear ones, he loves you, loves you, loves you, my dear children. And this made Jesus a little occupied. And while they were going now, the news came from the house that his little child is totally dead, completely dead. The father was devastated devastated. But what did Jesus say? What did Jesus say? Mark's Gospel, 5th chapter, verse 36. Be not afraid. Be not afraid. Only believe. Only believe. Be not afraid. Only believe. See the words of Jesus. He is life. He is, Bible says, he has all power and authority in heaven and earth and certainly over the defeated hell. Jesus himself said, he is the God of all flesh. John 17 verse 2, Matthew 28 verse 18. Why do you fear? Why do you fear? B believe, know that he lives, know that he lives, believe that he lives. Come and receive, come and receive. If you receive Jesus, you receive the whole of heaven while living on this earth until rapture and eternal in heaven. If you receive Jesus, if you, Jesus is telling you to come to him, come, you go and you say, Lord, here I am. And he is inviting you. He is offering himself to you. He is offering everything of heaven to you and to me and to all. He says, come and dine. He loves you, loves you, loves you, my loving children. And then the father heard this. He is an ordinary man. He, is, he was devastated, shattered. He thought everything was over. But when Jesus is with us, nothing is over. On the contrary, everything big begins new, everything begins good, everything begins everlasting, everything begins wonderful, everything begins, there is a wonderful start, there is a wonderful beginning, there is an everlasting beginning, there is an everlasting start, there is a good beginning, a good start when Jesus is with us today. Believe, be sure, sure. Oh, lift your hands and say, Lord, I'm sure you are with me. I'm sure you are in me. He loves you. All your tears will be over. All your pain will be over. My loving children, my beloved children, he loves you. He loves you. He loves you. He loves you. He is there for you. He is on your side. Rejoice, rejoice, rejoice. He will never leave you, never forsake you. My dearest children, he loves you, loves you, loves you. He is there for you. And Jesus took the father to the home. He said, be not afraid, only believe. The, other, the second part of the journey, Jesus took the father. The first part of the journey, the father, father of that girl, father of that girl took Jesus. When everything became so unbearable, unbearable. Jesus said, come, I will take you. That's what happens in all our lives. When we feel helpless, when we feel hopeless, when we feel everything is gone, the blood is still there. 
The blood is still there. The blood of Jesus never fails. The blood of Jesus gives a good beginning to us, a good start, an everlasting start, an everlasting beginning. Yes, the old is passed away. The old failures and mistakes and sins are old losses are passed away passed away rejoice rejoice he loves you loves you loves you all things are made new second corinthians 5 17 and all things are from the lord jesus christ second corinthians 5 18 he loves you loves you loves you don't think of the old that's why speak words of life speak words of victory speak words of faith he loves you know him know him he is risen he is risen. Oh, he has forgiven all our sins and the consequences of our sin, the nature of sin and the authority of sin. We are not sinners. We are his children. We are his children. He is our father. Even now he will cleanse us, wash us. He loves you, loves you, loves you. My dear children, Jesus took him home. When we feel helpless, when we feel hopeless, the heavenly Father is there. Jesus, the Savior, loving God, is there for us. He is the Savior. He is the Savior. He will save us all the time. He will save us all the time. He loves you, loves you, loves you. And my dearest children, He is there for you. He is there for you. He will never leave you, never for forsake you, never forget you. Everyone can forget you. He will never forget us. He will always be with us. He loves you. That's why he rose from the dead. That's why he's risen with his body, seated at the right hand of the Father, ascended into heaven, King of kings, Lord of lords, our God Almighty, Savior and Father. Oh, he loves you. Our healer, our healer, our deliverer. He is healing you, healing you. Again, the Holy Spirit tells me acute back pains, acute pains in your back, in your leg, in your knees, in your thighs. It's all going away. Uh, defeated, 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 paralytic, arthritis pains, rheumatic pains, defeated ailments in your muscles, in your bones, in your nerves are going away, going away. Lift your hands and receive, lift your hands and receive, lift your hands and receive. Holy Spirit is at work. The Spirit of the living God, the Father, Father is at work in Jesus' name, in Jesus' name. He is healing you, delivering you, saving you. Oh, just receive Jesus. Just don't, don't say, Lord, heal me this, do this for me. Just receive Jesus, receive Jesus, receive Jesus. Oh, he calls you, he calls us, he asks us to come. He loves you. Jesus went into that house. Jesus went into that house. And they were wailing and weeping and music and all kinds of songs or whatever they were singing. Matthew 9, Matthew 9, verse 24 says, Jesus says, give place. He asked all of them who were making noise to go away. He asked all of them who were making unwanted noises to go away. He said, give place. For the gentle Savior to come. Give place for the gentle, almighty, powerful Holy Spirit to come. He loves you. He loves you. He loves you. He is our gentle shepherd, our good shepherd, our great shepherd Jesus. He comes now in the darkest moment of your life when you feel helpless, home, hopeless. He is doing it for you now, saving you, saving you, protecting you, protecting you, your child, your family, healing you. Yes, under his wings, under his wings, under his holy wings, the Holy Spirit is holding us. We are safe, safe, safe always. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do not fear your home, your family, all of us, our generation, under the blood of Jesus, under the wings of the Holy Spirit. Yes, we are safe under the mighty power of the Holy Spirit. We are safe under the blood of Jesus. We are safe under the living word of God. We have life, 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 and we are safe. Rejoice. He loves you. It's a good beginning today, everlasting beginning, a wonderful beginning today. Jesus sent them all away. 
He said, give place. Let us give place today. Let us lift our hearts to him and lift our hands to him and say, Lord, I give place to you. I give place to you. Tell him, tell him, tell him. And Jesus went to that girl. He only took the mother and the father and Peter, James, John, who were one with him in the love of heaven, in the love of the father in heaven. The love, the love, the love. That's what we need, my beloved, the love of Jesus, the true love of Jesus. Not just talking, not just talking from our innermost being, from our innermost being. That's why this ministry is well known and well loved. The amount of people that the Lord Jesus makes us and enables us to help and support every month, every month in various countries, in Sri Lanka, in India, in Africa, in Burma, in Nepal, in Philippines, oh, in Europe, my loving children, Pakistan, my loving children, how many precious, precious dear ones going through hardships, hardships, oh, my loving children, oh, remember this is such a, we are well known and well loved for this also, helping and supporting continuously how many people it's increasing but we never refuse you must know these widows destitutes orphans servants of god in all these countries so many countries african continent again i repeat india pakistan sri lanka burma philippines nepal europe oh how people are going through hardships hardships my loving children and many more and this ministry of ours, God bless every one of you. Jesus bless every one of you who are faithful, faithful in your tithes and in your offerings to the church. Don't miss a Sunday service, Sunday morning, Sunday evening. Don't miss a Sunday morning, Sunday evening main services and all the other facets, all the other facets in every language, every language. But the main services, Sunday morning, Sunday evening, oh, you will be rewarded, rewarded. It's an everlasting reward. It's all the love of Jesus, love of Jesus, love of Jesus, love of Jesus. My loving children, oh, we will do more. We will do more as good Samaritans. That's what the Lord Jesus said. We must be good Samaritans spiritually and practically, spiritually and practically, not uh, talking, uh, talking and shouting and making noise. Jesus said, give place. And he went in, the gentle savior, the faithful Lord, and he put his hand on that child and said, rise, young girl, I say unto you, rise. Talita Humi, you know it, it's in the Bible. Today he places his hand on you, your family, your child, your children, your finance, your future, your ministry, all of us, all of us, our generation, until rapture and eternal. He's placing his hand on us personally, personally, personally. He loves you, loves you, loves you, loves you, loves you. He's putting his hand on you personally. My son, my daughter, my child, yes, he's raising you, he's raising you that girl received life 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 breath came into her breath came because the Bible says Jesus gives breath to all and life to all Acts of the Apostles 17th chapter verse 25 26 27 28 yes he is life Deuteronomy 30 verse 20 he gives life and breath to us we will live 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 until rapture and eternal with our child and family and generation your children and generation in or in whatever way you are he loves you loves you loves you it's a good beginning wonderful beginning everlasting beginning he told that girl, young girl, I say unto you, rise. That's the word of the creator. He is the creator, Jesus. John 1, verse number 3. He is the creator. Oh, he loves you, loves you, loves you. And he says, today to all of us, rise and live. And she rose 
She rose with life, life, life immediately. Today, faith is rising inside you. Hope is rising inside you. Joy is rising inside you. Lift your hands and receive. No more sorrow, no more sorrow. Peace is rising inside you. Yes, you are going to have a wonderful beginning from now, from now. He loves you, any one of you, every one of you. He loves you, loves you, loves you. Rise and live. And he told the parents, the mother and father, how much joy they would have had, uncontrollable joy from uncon unbearable sorrow to uncontrollable joy, from unbearable sorrow to uncontrollable joy. It's now. Jesus is doing it now. Lift your hands and receive, my children, no matter who you are. He loves you. And he told the mother and father, give us something to eat. Oh, that's the Savior. Oh, he loves you, loves you, loves you. Are you ready to receive this miracle? Your faith will rise, your hope will rise, your joy and peace will rise. Good opportunities of blessings will rise in your life. Holiness, holiness will rise. Everything of Jesus, every character and nature of Jesus will rise within us. Oh, he loves you. We will live. Victory is rising now. Victory and triumph is rising now. Rejoice 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 oh dear ones he loves you loves you loves you we are going to give you two minutes oh life is rising now in your bones in your blood in your lungs in your heart everywhere in your brain cells life 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 the blood of Jesus is going to flow powerfully powerfully now Holy Spirit is going to work in every cell of your body your spirit your soul every fear will go every death every curse will go no no more death, no more curse, no more sin. He loves you, loves you, but such a joy will fill you. You will know that you are loved, you are loved, you are loved. You are not alone, you are not alone, you are not alone. You will know it, my loving children. Yesterday, uh, uh, I got a frantic call and I had to answer and people were trying to contact me. A dear child, a dear child was uh, planning to end, end her life, her life. A child who has no father, no mother, no father, no mother, no money. My love just having a little here and there. My loving and was wanting to end the life. And some or other frantically, uh, I, I was asked to, I was contacted and asked to pray. And the great Holy Spirit came. I took the line. I took in another country. I took the line. It was yesterday and spoke to that child. Oh, dear one, and gave her the love of Jesus, love of Jesus, and an assurance, and an assurance. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit did it, Holy Spirit did it. And she was weeping. And, and then after a couple of minutes, as the great Lord Jesus empowered me and gave his love and compassion to me to pray for her, the great love of Jesus filled her. The love of Jesus, that Jesus is there for her, that she is going to live, she is going to live a blessed life. Oh, dear ones, he loves you, loves you, loves you. What a joy after almost 15 minutes on the phone. Life came to her, life came to her, joy came to that child. She was rejoicing and the great Holy Spirit made me to tell her, we are there for you. It's not just praying and preaching and going on. We must be Jesus Christ. We must be the ambassadors of Christ to the broken heart, to those who have nothing, to those who have no hope on this earth. We must be the true representation of Jesus, practically, practically and spiritually. That is why this ministry is well loved, well known, well sought after because of Jesus and his Holy Spirit. He loves you. He loves you. Two minutes we are going to give you. We will all come to Jesus. We will tell, Lord, I need you. We need you. We need you. And we will dine with Jesus. Take his life into us, his love, his life, and his victory into us right now. Tell him, Jesus, I need you. Jesus, I need you. Tell him that when this wonderful, powerful, anointed song of our one and only daughter, Divina, comes. Oh, beloved ones, all of us, I humbly, humbly, humbly request you, great children, great people of God, great children, great people, let us ask the Holy Spirit and tell him we need Jesus. We need Jesus. 
to fill us. When Jesus comes, everything of heaven, the whole of heaven is in us. So let us ask Jesus to fill us. Two minutes, we will tell him, we need you, Lord. Come, come. Jesus loves you, loves you. You don't have to fear anymore, anymore at all. He loves you, he loves you. We are going to take the bread and wine. Oh, he loves you. That's, a, that's the memory of his love, his love, his love. It's not money or silver or gold or show. It's love. It's the holy, holy love of Jesus. He loves you, loves you, loves you, loves you. My dear children, the night that Jesus was betrayed, he took bread, blessed it, break it and gave it to the disciples and said, eat, this is my body that is broken for you. Do this in remembrance of me. His holy body broken for a sinner like me and all of you dear ones, blessed ones, anyone, anywhere, anyone, anywhere. Jesus loves you, loves you, loves you. in like manner he took the cup gave thanks to the father in heaven mighty god and gave it to the disciples and said drink ye all of it for this is my blood of the new covenant that is shed for you and for many for the remission of sins do this as often as you can in remembrance of me and jesus said henceforth i will not drink of this fruit of the wine until that day when I drink it new with you in my Father's kingdom. Until that day when I drink it new with you in my Father's kingdom. Until that day when I drink it new with you in my Father's kingdom. Yes, He is faithful. He is cleansing us. Cleanse me, Lord, whiter than snow. Cleanse me. Hallelujah. He loves you. His blood is life. He is risen, his body is victory and life for us. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, thank you. He's going to bless you. He's going to bless you. He will continue to bless you. Even this few minutes, just look unto him. Look unto him, not to any man or a woman. Oh, we are all ordinary people. We are nothing. I am nothing. I am nothing. But the great Lord Jesus, the mighty one of Israel is there for you. The faithful Savior, mighty God. He loves you, loves you, loves you, loves you. You will receive your miracle. Every defeated fear is going away. Yes, just the hand of Jesus upon you as he touched that girl. He's touching you. He's touching you. He's 
touching you with his word, with his love, with his power, with his Holy Spirit, with his physical hand. He is touching you and the mighty power of the Holy Spirit is coming and filling you. Jesus tells me every defeated headaches, every defeated headaches, every defeated ear blocks, pain in your ears are all leaving. Every defeated nasal blocks and sinus headaches are leaving. Every defeated burning pains in your eyes, in your eyes, in your foreheads is leaving. Holy Spirit is healing you. The Spirit of the living God, the mighty one of heaven. Oh, hallelujah. He is healing you. He is healing you. Every defeated ailment in your neck, in your shoulders, in your shoulders, in your neck, at the back of your head is leaving. Every defeated ailment in, in your in in your chest, in your chest, in your ribs, yes, uh, in your ribs, in your chest, uh, every defeated pain and defeated symptoms are leaving. Every defeated wounds in your body are healed, healed, healed. Every defeated skin ailment, skin rashes, skin wounds are healed, healed by the stripes of Jesus, by the stripes of Jesus. Every defeated back pains, back pains, every defeated ailment in your back, in your spine is leaving. Every defeated ailment in your legs, in your feet is leaving every defeat and numbness, numbness and f no feelings and nerves not working. Jesus is delivering you, delivering you. Every defeated fear is going away. Every defeated fear of death or sin or curse is going away. Yes, you will overcome, you will overcome, you will overcome, you will live, receive, receive, receive. Every defeated ailment in your throat is leaving. Every defeated breathing, breathing, disorders are leaving. Yes, he is healing you in your lungs, in your lungs, in your lungs. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Every defeated fear is leaving. Every defeated breathing difficulties are leaving. Every defeated stomach ailments, intestinal ailments, stomach, kidney ailments are leaving. Every dis defeated digestive disorders are leaving. Gastric ailments are leaving. Chest pains are leaving. Every defeated ailment in your heart is it's leaving in your valves, in your arteries, veins, the blood is flowing, blood is flowing, blood is flowing. Every defeated blood clots are breaking open everywhere. Brain cells are receiving oxygen, oxygen and blood. Jesus is healing you. Yes, every defeated sinful addictions are leaving. Every defeated unbelief, unbelief, unbelief. Lethargy, lethargy is leaving. Yes, a new desire, new love for the Bible, for the word, for the house of God for the church is coming. Yes, eh, not leaning in our own understanding. Jesus is putting a new love, new desire for church and the Bible and the Holy Spirit and his blood and his mighty works, greater works. Yes, his love, his love, his love, his compassion. Yes, for others to be good Samaritans to others, good Samaritans. Yes, rise up. He's healing your legs, your legs. Rise up and walk. He's healing your legs. He's healing your thighs. He's healing every Every muscle of yours, yes, everywhere, every defeated fear, every defeated worry, every defeated tensions, don't, don't en encourage them in your mind. Let them go, let them go. Every defeated unforgiveness, unforgiveness is leaving. Love, 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 love of Jesus is filling, yes. He loves you. Everything wonderful, everything everlasting is beginning now in your family, in your personal life, in your finance, in your job, in your business, in your home, in your ministry. Receive, 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 receive. Thank you, Claude, Claude. Receive, 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 receive. Ranjan, receive, 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 receive. Rani, Rani, receive, Rani, receive. Every defeated ailment in the chest, everywhere. Jesus is healing. New joy, new joy, new peace new hope, new faith, new life, new life is rising, rise up and live. Young man, I say unto you, young girl, I say unto you, young child, I say unto you, rise and live. Talita humi, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. The Holy Spirit is reigning into your body, into your ears, everywhere, everywhere.
everywhere. You are healed, 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 healed. Stanley, Stanley, fear not, fear not. Holy Spirit is healing every intestine, every blood. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Reginald, Reginald, receive, 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 receive. Felix, 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 receive, receive, receive. Come and dine, come and dine. The old is passed away. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. It's new beginning, wonderful beginning, joyful beginning, everlasting beginning. Receive, 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 receive. Everywhere, skin rashes are healed, healed, healed. Kidneys are healed. Urinary tracts are healed. Receive. Don't be frightened. Don't be frightened. Rise and receive, 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 receive. He loves you, loves you, loves you, loves you. Amen, 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 amen. Dear ones, He loves you. You will know he has healed you. Testify, testify. Send the testimonies by email to us. Send the testimony by any social media to us. We will praise Jesus, praise Jesus. Send the prayer request, send the prayer request with tears. Oh, the Lord will turn and look at you. He will heal you. Send the prayer request. We will always pray. This is a good Samaritan church. Oh, don't ever miss Sunday morning, Sunday evening services in Basha, in Basha. Now the transports are there, uh, the train services are there, train services, wonderful transport in that country. And the, the, uh, the people can help one another. Sunday is a holiday, Sunday is a holiday. Jesus is doing great thing and all the other languages, all the other languages, my great sons, my senior pastors, my great sons, great pastors are doing everything. Jesus loves you, loves you, loves you. And one more announcement next, next Sunday, that is the 10th, 10th, next Sunday, we have a wonderful, wonderful man of God, a great son of mine, great son of mine, mighty man of God, wonderful, a true man of God, well-renowned, world-renowned servant of God will be there with us on uh, Sunday, the 10th, the 10th of July in Basha, Sunday morning, Sunday evening in Basha. So bring new people, bring new people. And, so, and those who are sick, those who are in difficult situations, don't miss 10th uh, July, uh, the next uh, Sunday. My loving children, a wonderful, great man of God, great apostle, great pastor, precious son of mine. Oh, hallelujah. He loves you. He's, he'll be there. My loving children, Sunday morning, Sunday evening in Basha. So expect great things, believe great things, know that Jesus is our great God. He loves you, loves you, loves you, loves you. He loves you, he loves anyone, anywhere, anyone, anywhere. This is a international broadcast. So anyone, anywhere, Jesus loves you, loves you, loves you. See you again, my loving children. See you again, see you again. And until rapture, until rapture, we will see you again. The Lord will do great things, great things, great things. Jesus loves you, loves you, loves you. See you again, always, and expect great things from your great God, your great Father. He loves you, see you again. Jesus loves you, loves you, loves you until rapture and eternal. See you again. Pastor, this is Majori. She's got two testimonies. For almost two months, Pastor, she's been suffering with hemorrhoids in her body. And she said last Sunday, she believed in a healing, went home, checked herself. The hemorrhoids completely disappeared, completely healed from that. And also, Pastor, the Lord has blessed her with a job. She's giving God the glory. Double, double. It's all. All the hemorrhoids gone. And God has blessed her with a job also. Lift your hand, child, and say thank you to Jesus. Thank you to Jesus. Thank you to Jesus.